Hey guys, as promised, here's my new Hakko 936 soldering station. This is the base unit right here. <clears throat> this is the soldering holder. What I like about the soldering holder, it's all metal. No plastic anywhere except for the decals which are interestingly from Upgrade. They make skins for all kinds of stuff. I don't know. Haven't turned it on. I just got it out the box. And I hadn't seen any YouTube videos on it, so this is the first one I'll post. This is the iron. It's pretty lightweight. They got a nice Hakko decal on there. I'm not sure if it's Hakko, 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 or whatever. But anyway, it's nice and light. As you can see, it connects via tether to the, the station. And it screws on. Um... You unscrew the tip or change the tip by unscrewing that thing and pop. There you go. I guess that's the ceramic element in there right there. So you can pop that back on. I got this off of eBay. I paid retail for it, but you know, when you want the best, you gotta splurge a little. I would have loved to have gotten a, um, digital workstation this is the an analog and put that back in there and just do a little, do a little 3d modeling for you guys um, the guy that I got it from on eBay actually threw in a, another tip with it. It's a nice big chisel tip. And here it is. That looks nice and beefy. And it's a 900L-T-S1. And it's also from Hakko. The tip that comes on it isn't bad either. That's pretty nice. Sorry, you got a little solder on there. You know, I'm sure that's part of the, you know, building of the, um, of the soldering station and the iron. But, that's it. Um, I'll probably post some more stuff once I actually get used to, um, the iron. They also send you a, um, they say if you fill out their warranty card, you'll get a two-year warranty with it. I'm not really sure what the regular warranty is, but, you know, two-year warranty on something is pretty good. So, if you get it, fill out that warranty card. I'll also, um, rotate the workstation. There's the on and off switch not much to it you know simple on and off switch and there's the side of it and the back of it it's a nice beefy station the box that it came in was huge I don't know <laughs> I guess I wasn't sure what I was expecting Oops, sorry about that but um yeah, for 89 bucks, I think it's well worth the price, you know, and um, like I said, I hadn't seen, I think I saw one YouTube video on it, and it was from the company, so I wanted to put something else out there, and, uh, you know, put a little user feedback out there. Thanks for checking out the video, and if you're interested in a 
quality analog soldering station, the Hako 936 will probably work for you. Thanks and enjoy.